Hello everybody, I am Bala Subramanian and I am excited to introduce my channel Class of Python where it's all about learning to code in Python. As a pro programmer, I will be explaining about how to learn Python in easy way and use it a better way. I had the experience of doing many hands-on projects on my own and I pretty much like to share my knowledge. Without getting late, let's get started. Introduction to Python What is Python? Python is a high-level interpreter language with dynamic semantics. Why we need Python? It is easy to code in Python because code which you write will be less than any code which you are writing in other languages like C, C++, Java. And it has many packages which are very useful and you can use anytime you need it. When it is started, December 1989, Guido van Rossum at Centrum Viskunde Informatica at Netherlands introduced this Python language which is a successor to ABC language. Key features of Python There are some key features that allow us to use Python language very efficiently. Those are easy to code. Python language gives us the ability to code very easy with its less code. It is free and open source. You can download the source code and share it with anybody. And it supports object oriented concepts like classes, objects, etc. And it supports GUI programming using packages like tkinter, tqt5, etc. It's a high level language and its extensible feature allows us to write some part of Python code in C or C++ and execute it. Python is portable language. We can write Python code in Windows and execute in Mac and vice versa. It is an integrator language and which is interpreted also. What is interpreter language? Interpreter language means unlike C, it executes program line by line at a time. It has large standard library so that we don't need to code everything which we want. We can get some of the features from the packages. And it is dynamically typal language. What is meant by dynamically typal language? Which means whenever we declare a variable, we don't need to specify the data type. Because Python is dynamically typed, it allows the memory of the system to store if the value is int, it takes as int. And if the value is float, it takes the variable as float, etc. And this is pretty much all about introduction to Python. If you like the video, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell icon to get notified every time I post an awesome new video on Python.